Here is bobbing back. Uh, she today is the 31st of December, so tomorrow she'll be turning 22. And uh, she's the mother of many clouds and the taller tank. Sure, and, and she uh, the taller tank the year after she had many clouds, but taller tank met his mark sooner. He did. That's correct. That is correct. Um, he won the two grade ones and was heading for a third one, and he didn't do it in Leprosol. I can't even remember now where he finished. But uh, yeah, she two runners and two black types, and uh, she's a good old servant. And she had a filly full. 2017 and she's gone to a lady in Yorkshire and they've already named her named her very fast Heavenly Clouds so they said they'll go racing and she'd probably go to he Emma Lavelle lovely stuff and is she back in fall at the moment she's in fall to Yates um, difficult enough last year I suppose at her age to get her in fall but she's in fall and yet thank you for that much and in one way hoping for a filly which is not the normal thing but uh, we'll take what we'll get sure and you're breeding from a, another a daughter of hers. And I'm breeding from the Tuller Tanks, full sister whose name is Autumn Clouds. And she had a walk in the park filly last year and this year. And she's back and forth to walk in the park for 2019. Lovely stuff. And uh, how special was it breeding a winner of the Grand National? Ash, it was unbelievable. I wasn't there, but it was unbelievable. And it was, it was nice that the entry named the race after him afterwards. And Newbury having named some kind of a betting ring or something after him. So it was nice to have. People still talk about how good he was like. Lovely stuff. And how did you originally buy into the family? I had her younger sister, who I named back online, and she won a point to point and she went in training with Phoenicia Williams and she got black type in Newbury and then I heard that she, she had raced in France and I heard that she was back in Wexford. So I went down to see her and I bought her off of a lady in Wexford who had raced her in France. She ran in Chateau Brion. But uh, she ran in a bumper for me in Cork and her claim to fame is she was fifth and Solarina was second. So that was nearly as good as she did. Uh, and her own mare then, Belly Vanine, she was a very good mare as well. She won I think three or four points of points, I think for any Woods Roder, but that was before I knew anything about the family.